Okay, now you guys should be able to see this. Great. All right, so we're recording. Um, if you want to make me larger on your screen, all you got to do is click my hand right over here. A pin should, uh, or click my hand right there, a pin should appear. And then just click the pin, and then I should become larger on your screen. Okay, now, what we did last week was this. We talked about writing our name in the front of the book, which is great. Mine says, Mr. Mill, yours should say your name. And then if we open up to the first page, we can see what we've been working on. All right, we talked about the element of art of lines. We talked about how Larry the snake, how he moves. So we talked about up and down, diagonal and horizontal like this. We talked about where do we see lines in the world? Someone said Texas, another person said whiteboards, someone said zoo, and another person said webs, which is great. And then if I look down below, we talked about how many lines you guys already know. So over here, some people talk about these kind of lines, that's kind of line, that kind of line, and so on, which is great. You guys did a great job last week. So next up is if we just flip the page over like this, you can see what we're doing next. So you should have a blank sheet right here. So this blank rectangle right there. And then on this side, it's a page about lines, OK? So this is where it comes in handy if you have something to write with, like me. I'm going to use a marker so it turns out better on camera. Sometimes pencil doesn't work so great on camera, so I'm not going to use a pencil, OK? But if you already did it, that's fine too. If you already did it, just watch. All right, here we go. So the first line is called straight line. So what you're going to do with your writing utensil, you're going to try your best to draw a straight line as best as you can all the way across. Okay. And again, if you don't have this handout or this packet readily available, I did it on a blank sheet of paper. So a blank sheet of paper works just as well. Okay. I'll leave it right here. All right. Who could tell me by raising their hand, what's the next line? Anyone know? Paige, what's the next line? Like wave type of thing. She's right. I'm going to draw a wavy line. Here we go. Woo. All right. Awesome job. Wavy lines, it is. Who can tell me what the next line is? Anyone know? Anyone know? I saw Ziola's hand up first. Zigzag. Zigzag. Good job. I appreciate you guys participating. Good job. Thanks for raising your hands, guys. All right, next one. This one is a little bit more confusing because it reminds me of like where you cut. What's this next line called? Anyone know? Dietrich. Dot lines. Yeah, dotted lines or also known as dashed lines. Good job. So it's kind of like a straight line for this one in particular. I'm creating spaces in between. Just like that. Awesome. Okay, who could tell me what this next one could be? Oliver, what's this next one? Squiggly. Good job. Squiggly or curly. And I'm just going to go like this. Kind of makes me look like I'm drawing cursive, right? Kind of cool. Awesome. All right, who could tell me what this next one is? And if you guys are falling behind, it's okay. I don't mean to go fast, but um, I want to make sure we get this done. Who can tell me what this next line could be? What is this one called? What does it look like? I'll give you a hint. It's based on the video that we did this week. What could this line be called? I'm going to pick Ellie. What is this line called? Want to take a guess? Um, here, Ellie, try again. I think uh, you're muted, I think. It's okay. Um, cat, like it's castle? Yep, correct. Good job. Oh, uh, castle lines, like this. Awesome job. Okay, I muted you. That's fine. All right, the next line. Who could tell me what this next line could be called? I'll give you a hint. It's based off of an animal. 
Sean, what is this next line called? Waves. You're super close, but you know what? You're very close. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to give it to you. It could be really sharp waves or called sharks. Shark lines. Good job. Shark lines or waves. So Sean is technically correct still because it kind of does look like waves kind of. Good job. All right. Who could tell me what the last one is? Anyone? Who wants to tell me what the last one is? Brian, I saw your hand up first. Spirals. Good job. Spirals or swirls. Good job. And again, if you did this worksheet already and you're just watching, that's fine. Um, and if you want to go the opposite direction, you could do the opposite direction too. I want to go different directions. There you go. Ta-da! All done. Great. All right, I'm going to wait a couple more seconds. And then I'll talk about what to do on the left side of the packet. All right. So if you don't have this packet and you did it on a blank sheet of paper, like how I demonstrated over here, you can either use the back of this or you can just watch or get another sheet of blank sheet of paper. If you do have the packet, like how I have right here, you should have this page right here where it's a nice blank rectangle. And you can either draw it with it uh, rectangular, uh, straight up and down like this, or you can draw it what you're supposed to draw it like this. Okay, you can either hold it horizontal, we can hold it vertical like this, okay? So what you're gonna draw is this. You have a couple options. You're gonna draw a scene using every single type of line with a scenery. So over here, I drew like kind of like a castle theme with like wavy bushes, swirly uh, clouds. I did like shark lines by the castle. On this example over here, I did a beach on a blank sheet of paper. So I did like wavy lines for the waves. I did a straight line for the sand. I added like a towel with dotted lines. So what you're gonna do on this blank page, I want you guys to create a scene of your choice. So it could be a playground, you could draw a house, you could draw Chicago. I want you guys to draw some type of scene on this blank sheet of paper right now. Okay, so I'm gonna hold mine up here so you guys can see. If you guys wanna unpin me, that's fine. So that's what I want you guys to do right now. Kayla, what's your question? Did you mean this side? Because um, I before I think I was supposed to draw the um tree and stuff on this side. Could you either, show them the lines by here? Either page works. But this one I already draw something. Fine. Either page works. Either page works. Good job. Uh, that's a good question. And again, if you don't have this packet, a blank sheet of paper like how I did like this works well, okay? So again, if you don't have this packet, a blank sheet of paper works fine, or just watching is great too. And again, this is pre-recorded, so, or this is gonna be a recorded session. So you can always do this again on your own time. And with that said, we have about four minutes left. Um, if you wanna show me what you've done so far, you can hold it up to your screen. If you need more time, keep going. All right, Oliver, can you do me a favor? Can you say hi? And then that way we could see your picture because I know you want to share yours. Uh, I can't hear you, Oliver. There you go. What? Uh, yeah, I just want to see you to say hi and then uh, show me your picture. Hi. Okay. Whoa, that's awesome. Good job. All right. Is there anyone else that wants to share? Just by raising their hand, and you could say unmute yourself and say hi, and then that way you can pop up for everyone's screen. Aaron, you want to say hi first, and then you can pop up on everyone's screen so they can see you. Hi. Okay. Show me yours. Whoa, that's a cool drawing. Nice. Is it is it going to be a building? It's going to be tree? a broken flag. Oh, smart. Good job. All right. I see Paige's hand up. Hi. Hello. All right, let's see what Paige's got. Oh, nice job. Oh, and you're showing me the other side too. Nice. Ooh, you have a nice picture. Awesome. Oh, wow, that's a big castle. Nice. Hmm. All right. 
Uh, I see a lot more people finishing off. A lot of hard workers here. Malena, did you want to say hi so people can see yours? I can see you on my screen. You want to say hi? Oh, good job. <laughs> Brian, make sure you meet your mic, please. Good job, Melina. Good job. All right. We have time for probably one more. And with that said, once I pick someone, I'm going to turn my camera around. So does anyone else want to share? Dietrich, do you want to share? Hi. Whoa, that's amazing. Good job. All right, let me see how much time we have left. All right, we have still a minute left. I can have time for one more person. Anyone else want to share? Uh, let's see. I'm going to pick uh, Carter. Carter King. Hi. Hi. Oh, my gosh. You're a really detailed artist. Nice job, man. Good job. All right, the time now is 9.59. So uh, with that said, um, if you want to show me your artwork later next week or later on, if you don't right now, it's time to log off. So time to say goodbye, guys. See you later. See you later. Bye. 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 Bye.